Hi guys, it's Lane here and today on my channel I'm going to be doing things that have changed my shower routine. So let's just get started. I never really know what's going on. So for starters, I'm going to start with my hair care products just because that's obviously the most important to me personally. So for my everything shower, I use, and I'll have a pop-up of everything on the screen for you guys. I'm using the Shea Moisture, who knew, who, what the? F I'm using the Shea Moisture Makuna Honey and Fur Oil Intense Hydrating Hair Mask. This is the first thing that I put on after I start my shower, but the first thing that I do is do this M May Maui Moisture Scalp Care. Um, I'll have both of them. This one is okay. It's not my world's favorite. I'll have the other one on the screen that I really like. But this is all that Walmart had. But I'll put on the scalp oil for... I'll put on the scalp oil first. And then after the scalp oil, I'll rub it in. And then... I'll get all of my shower stuff ready and then by that time in my everything shower I'll go straight in with my hair mask and then I usually put my hair in a claw clip if I remember to bring a claw clip in the shower um, but I'll leave this in and then I'll do the rest of my shower routine and then I'll take this off. We all know my tried and true. I've been using these product, well, the Monday brand for a while, and let me tell you, these, for someone who uses them, and I, you guys know, I, I have a lot of hair, I have thick hair, uh, these last forever. I think I buy these every three to six months. Um, depending on how much hair I have and how much my hair has grown. But this is the Monday Smooth Wheat Protein for Curly and Frizzy Hair. I have frizzy hair, so I think this works for me. But I've never done anything to my hair. I've never dyed it. I've never temporarily dyed it. This is untouched hair and this is sun bleached hair. Honestly, these are my tried and true and these do not make me itchy. I also usually before this I'll do a scalp scrub but I have been so dumb recently and not been putting that on the list so I'll have the one that I really really like on the screen for you guys but I'll do a scalp scrub if I'm doing my everything shower I'll do my scalp scrub and then I'll do the hair mask but if I'm just doing a regular shower, I'll do my uh, scalp oil, um, scalp uh, exfoliator, and then I'll do my shampoo and conditioner. And the nice thing about these is on the caps, it has shampoo and conditioner on it. It says S for shampoo and C for conditioner, which is nice. The, the list of no products, no sulfates, no paraffin, no parabens. It's just like so many good things about it. I really like it and honestly, they're not that expensive. And for someone who's frugal with their money or cheap, you know what I'm saying. Now for after the shower, I use the Meal Rosemary Mint Blend Strengthening Leave-In Conditioner. I, you guys know, if you guys watch my channel regularly, you guys know that, or if you guys just go back into any of my shower routines, skincare routine, anything, you guys know I have used Garnier, I've used so many different brands, and honestly, this is the brand that I like the most. A, because it actually is making my hair longer. Now my hair grows really fast, but this has been doing double time and honestly I just really like the smell of it and it's a thick consistency that's the only thing that's like a a meh for me it's a thick consistency but I've grown to like it because with the more like the less thick versions of like leave-in conditioners like this 
I end up using a whole bunch that I don't need. So this one gets straight to the point and I love it. So now we're just kind of going into the shower routine products, like stuff that's like just miscellaneous in my shower routine. First of all, if you guys know, you know, these products and I am currently missing one, actually two. I'm currently missing one. I'm missing, blah, 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 blah. I'm missing the shave, the like shaving gel or whatever. I think it's a shaving gel. Um, I'm missing that, but I need to get it. But this is the Venus Shave Down There Girl Edition styled. Um, I have sensitive freaking skin and if you guys watched Monday's video, you guys know that I have been kind of on my gut health journey, but like that's just for that video. But I have been on the hunt for products that are going to do me good and these products are doing me good. The only thing is, is honestly, if, and for y'all men or people who don't want to hear it, you might want to skip a few and I'll have it down below, but um, like I'll have where you want to skip. But for me, I have stretch marks. So, um, I couldn't tell if these were giving me razor burn. These products don't give me razor burn. They don't make me itchy. And honestly, if I ever get to the point where I get itchy, I'll use the Daily Soothing Serum first and then I'll go in with the oil. I Honestly, that's just how I roll. But these products do me so good. A little goes a long way for these, so I'll do obviously the exfoliator first and then I'll go and shave with the razor. I just need a new razor head. What I learned about these, and, and this is not um, sponsored at all, but what I learned is that this, like the razor head, the attachment piece that I don't have on, is, um, I'll have it on the screen, but it like the way the razor is it prevents it from nicking you which is tried and true it is it never gave me nicks or anything like that and if y'all girl know y'all girls know what i'm talking about it hurts down there if you nick yourself especially in the little crevices if you girls know you know but yeah this brand and I you guys have known like the video has been out there for a very long time and these are all first first products I just need more gel for like the shaving gel love these products I forgot but this is my scalp scrubber I have another one I have a duck one um this is just the eco tools one I got it for target or from I got it from target for like four dollars but I love that thing. It is so nice on your well, on your scalp, really. Personally, for me, I find that these are cheap and I love them. And these, this is just the Equate brand. I'll have the box on the screen for you guys. This is just the Equate brand. But the problem that I had is I was using the wrong amount of blades. I like five blade. I went. Uh, for a while I was using the Truly brand um, and I loved it because it had multiple blades because I was at the time like right before that I was using just the regular Bic single blade ones. I like multiple blades because I don't go I don't go too crazy and having and having multiple blades makes it a lot easier to not have to like reshave over and over again. So my shower routine went from like 30 minutes to about 15 with this. And if you know, you know I shave my legs every single time I'm in the shower. And I have been using the Tree Hut Scrub um, for a while now. I don't have it, but usually I'll exfoliate first. And then I'll go in with the Tree Hut um, Moisturizing Shave Oil. I have used shaving gel and I hated it. 
I don't mind shaving cream, but I've noticed shaving oil gives that kind of like baby oil effect. Like if you guys know, you know, the baby oil effect just gives it the shine, but this shit is next level. It does it in one single, one single bottle, which is nice. Cause I used to use the baby oil trick going from two bottles to one is so nice especially when you share a bathroom like I do we only have one bathroom in this house so it's very tight on space for all of us and this shaving oil is the best I also um, have been trying to find a good body wash and I have used a vino I have used um, Bath and Body Works Pink's version, I've used Dove, I've used Olay. I have literally used almost every single thing you can think of. And the Tree Hut Scrub, first of all, doesn't make me itchy. And I've had this bottle for, I want to say like two-ish months, maybe. And I love it. And also the smell. Tree Hut Scrub is where it's at. I... If they could sponsor me, I have all of their products. I ha I don't have uh, shaving, um, shaving. I don't have the scrub, but I need to get some. But this shit is great. I love this shit. It, it just, it's a next level. Like, I know that sounds very weird and very crazy, but it's, it's fucking next level. I don't, like I said, ever 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 get itchy from this and like I said I have very sensitive skin I don't get any like I don't want to call them rashes but I don't want to call them pimples either like these weird little dots I don't get them either and honestly the smell lasts for hours go get you some I usually double cleanse oh I usually double cleanse and I'll go with the Natrium Fermented Camilla Creamy Cleansing Oil first and then I'll go in with the um, this product on the screen afterwards. I don't have that product but this shit honestly just using this for the past couple days has been working really well and I haven't gotten lots of pimples just from using this product so i love her double cleansing is so worth it to me at least i love double cleansing and honestly it doesn't take that much time in your day to double cleanse i only double cleanse at night but if y'all women out there double cleanse two times a day and it works freaking wonders for you let me know because i may have to i may have to try that out I use a Dr. Teal's, well, I should say I have this cocoa butter. Um, I mixed this with an EOS lotion as well. So I had two of these and it smells like peach, like coconut peach. <laughs> um, it smells so good and it's like extra, extra hydrating. I noticed that I have really dry skin like my legs are really dry and they like soak up all the moisture so this shit is just extra extra moisturizing and i never have a problem with my legs feeling dry throughout the day i love this shit and then right after this i'll go in with the dr teal's moisturizing body bath and body oil i use the shea butter and almond oil just again to get that extra moisture this gives extra moisture well it says helps soften and smooth dry skin so basically this combo is so good i also use the um tree hut moisturizer as well on my legs but i just don't have any and i have so much of this left so this combo is great I also, once a week, every Sunday, use, and I'll have it on the screen, 
I use the um, liquid version of like a Epsom salt and I soak my feet for 15 minutes in it and then I'll go and I'll shave like I'll uh, scrape my feet I'll scrape my feet for 15 minutes or I mean I'll scrape my feet and then I'll go do this combo and it works wonders and then usually I will um, lotion my feet one more time at night right before I go to bed works wonders love it I also forgot to grab it I also use a hair towel I got this one from Target at the Target that I go to they don't sell these anymore but um, I'll see if I can link it down below for you guys um, I'll have all the products linked down below as well as on the screen for you guys but this hair towel I had a different one um, and it wasn't working out for me but these hair towels first of all they have a button and then they have a little like loop-de-loop -loop, if you will and that combo works so well for me my mom has the Target version like the Target ones and they don't have a button but they only have a loop and to me that's a little confusing so spending the money that I have for this I also found one in the Target like dollar section like very similar to this um, for like five dollars max and the shit worked so well I love it and yeah that completes my shower like ultimate shower routine must-haves um if you guys have any questions comment them down below and if you got this far comment down the shower head emoji or the scrubs like the scrub emoji